All right, we've already covered quite a bit of ground. Uh, we've learned whole notes, half notes, quarter notes, and eighth notes. Um, all of all of our exercises so far uh, has only had one chord per measure, but that's not always the case. Many songs have multiple chord changes, um, and some are right in the mid smack of that measure, and sometimes they're at the front of the measure or at the end of the measure. Basically, what you need to be aware of is that you know chord changes are not going to always be easy and sometimes you're going to have quick chord changes and you need to be prepared for that. So in today's exercise we're going to play straight quarter notes so that's four notes per measure that we're going to strum. We use all down strokes. Um, the only difference is we're going to play, we're going to change the uh, chord halfway through the measure. So we're going to instead of playing just say four chords we're going to end up playing an eight chord progression. And of course some of the chords repeat over and over um, but these are the same chords that we have been using up to this point. Um, let's go ahead and try the exercise for the day. We're going to count it off at one, two, three, four, and then we're going to C chord, C chord, G chord, G chord, D chord, D chord, C chord, C chord, D chord, D chord, G chord, G chord, C chord, C chord, D chord, D chord, just like that. And let's try it at 80 beats per minute. And focus on getting those chord changes quick. One, two, three, four. 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 Let's try it a little faster. 96 beats per minute. One, two, three, four. 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 And if you have no problem changing chords at this point, uh, this exercise might be seem a little easier than say the last couple of exercises, but the rhythmic easiness will not last very much longer because as you'll see in our next lesson 10 we're gonna change it up a little bit we'll see you then